Damirun Monfasilun. Are you with me? How long ago we studied it? Hua huma hum? Huh? Are you with me? Hua huma hum. Iya huma hunna. Anta yantum ma yantum. Anti yantum ma yantunna. Ana nahnu. Ana nahnu. What is all this, brothers and sisters? These are all damirun, munfasilun, and they are all marfu. Huh? But at the same time, they are all mabni. Are you with me? So here, we are going to study the groups, which are, which are mabni, huh? which are not morab, huh? which are not Morab. So if they are not Morab, then they are Mabni. Fine. So, a Damair. What is the meaning of Damair? Pronouns. This example, Mislu. Huwa. Father. What will you say, Huwa? Mabniunala Fatah. Huh? Hum. Mabniunala Sukun. Anta. Mabniunala Fatah. Antum. Okay? And Ana. Bala Amamni Allah Sukun, not Fata. Huh? Okay, brother. Then there are other Damayers which are also Mabni. Okay. A, a huge lesson will come for Damayer. Huh? A huge lesson, brother, in which we'll study them again in thorough detail. That is the beauty of Dr. Abdurrahim's, uh, you know, vision and his farsightedness. You know. Things will come and they will make us understand better. Our understanding will become stronger and stronger. So brothers and sisters, huwa huma hum, hiya huma hunna, these are damair munfasilatum. Are you with me? Fine. Then there are other damair, okay, which are muttasilun, but they are also marfu. What did I say? Damair, Munfasilun, they are marfu. Then they are Damair, Muttasilun, which are marfu. And what are they? You already know them. Brother. These are, these are the attached pronoun in the verbs, huh? which come as a file. Huh? Remember, attached pronoun will come as a mafulun b also. But these are the file. What are they, brother? If you start in the Mahdi, Zahaba, where is the file? Mustatir. Huh? Are you with me? The file is Mustatir. Okay. And then, Zahaba, where is the file? Alif. No, Alif is your file, but it is a Damir. Are you with me? But, and it is Marfu. File has to be Marfu. And then, Zahabu, where is the file? Wow, it's the file. It's Marfu. It is attached. And then Zahabata and then Zahabna. Are you with me? And then Zahabta. What is Ta, brother? No, Zahabta. Oh. Huh? Ta is a file. It is attached. Sahi? No, file has to be Marfu. So Ta is your Marfu. It's Mabni. It's Marfu. Okay? And same way, Ta Tumatum, Ti Tumatun, Na Tu Na. So here, we are learning that Zahabtu, the two file is Marfu. Huh? But it is Mabni. Highlight it too, brothers and sisters. Huh? Highlight two and wow in the next verb. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Now, Kalu. What is kalu? It's a verb. Where is the file? Wow. No, wow has a sukun, but it is mabni. Huh? But it is marfu. Sahi? So these are all marfu. And they are mabni. We don't see them in the way we see Muhammadun. We don't see them in that way. Huh? But they are all mabni and they are marfu. What is the in the bracket written, brother and sister? Hadihi Damairu Rafai. These are the Damir Marfu. Fine, brother. 
Now, Rai to who? What is who? Wafulun bi. Brother, it has to be Mansub. I don't see anything there. Like Muhammadan. So it is Mabani. As Aluka. As Aluka. So what is Ka here? Mafulun bi. Okay? It is Mabani. And then Darabani. He hit me. So, yeah, it has got a sukun, but it is mafulun bi. I don't see the sign. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? I don't see the sign of uh, mansub. What are they called? Hazihi damairu nasbin. Fixed, brother. They are fixed, okay. Kitabuhu daftaruha ismuka. Alayha, Lana. What are these brothers and sisters? These are, what is, Hu, Ha, Ka, Ha, Mudafilehi, or Isam Majroor. Are you with me? Mudafilehi, or Isam Majroor. Okay? When the pronoun joins a noun, we get Mudaf, Mudafilehi. When the pronoun joins preposition, we get jarun wa majroorun. When the pronoun joins a zarf, what do we get? We get zarf and mudafilehi. So all these nouns are all majroor. Whether you join them with noun or whether you join them with preposition, or you join them with Zarf. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So, Hadihi Damairu Jarri. Are you with me? You will be able to figure out. And this little song that I presented to you, brother, it has a very deep meaning in it. You know, it will reinforce you that these Damair are all Majroor. Are you with me? Be the Isam Majroor. Or they are mudafilehi. Fine. That was group number one. What is the group number two, brothers and sisters? Asmaul isharati. We are quite familiar with it. Mislo. Hada. Hadihi. Zalika. Ulaika. These are all morab, but they are, they don't show their declension. They won't show their declined form. They are more up. They will come in the sentence performing different functions. They can come as a muptada. They can come as a khabar. They can come as a fa'il. They can come as a mafulun bihi. They can come as a ism majroor. They can come as a mudafilehi. Are you with me, brother and sister? But they won't show the end of it as we see in noun which is Mu'arab, huh? like Muhammadun, Muhammadan, Muhammadin, okay. So, in that case also, brothers and sisters, Hada Kitabun. This is a book. What is Hada? How will you describe now? Hada Ismu Shara Mabniun Allah Hada Mabniun Allah Sukun. What will you say after that? Fi mahali rafin, muftida. Fi mahali rafin, muftida. Will you say? Rai tu haza. I saw this. Now, rai tu. I need mafulun bi. What is haza? Ismu ishara. Mabniun ala sukun. Fi mahali nasmin. Mafulun bi. Got the idea? So it's very easy. You know, once you know couple of them, you can do everything inshallah. Fine, brother and sister. Except the dual form. Adani Vahatani. What are they? Muarabani. Muarabani. Brother and sisters. Now, in order to get a proper understanding of this concept, I'm going to write some sentences on the board, huh, brother and sisters. Because I want you to understand properly.
brothers and sisters, Alhamdulillah, we are familiar with this because we know how to analyze the duels. Remember? You know how to analyze duels because we did work on it. And that is the reason, brothers and sisters, I al always try to prepare uh, the students beforehand, bit by bit, so that when we come to the real stuff, we are prepared to understand it in a, in a very nice way. Okay, brothers and sisters. Ja'a hazani. What is hazani? Dual. You know, how is the dual marfu? By alif. And mansub and majroor? By ya. Okay, so what will you say? Ja'a fi'alun ma'din mabniun ala fatah. What about hazani? Hazani fa'ilun marfu'un and what is the alamatu rafa'ihi al alif and then we will add li annahu musanna in other words brothers and sisters hadhani and hatani will be dealt like duels as you describe and analyze duels you will analyze hadhani and hatani because they are not mabni hadha is mabni Hazani is Muarab. Uh, it will change. Uh, okay? Fine, brother. Ra'ay tu hazaini. Ra'ay fiel tu file. I need mafulun bihi. How will you say mafulun bihi? Hazaini. Mafulun bihi mansubun wa alamatu nasbihi al yahu liannahu musanna. Are you with me, brother and sister? Same way, salamtu means I said salamu alaikum or I greeted. Huh? Salamtu ala hazaini. So, brother, Allah came. What is hazaini? Ism majroor. Huh? Ismun majroorun wa alamatu jarrihi al yahu li annahu muthanna. So, it's easy, brothers and sisters. Same way, I wrote down an example for hazaini. Jaat. Why did I put Tao Tanisi? Because the file is monas. File is monas. So what is Hatani? Failun marfuun walamatu rafaihi al alifu li annahu musanna. Sisters, I'll repeat again. Salam to fiel and file. I greeted. I said salam alaikum. Allah hazaini. What is hazaini? Ismun uh, majroorun because of Allah. How will I describe? Hazaini. Ismun majroorun wa alamatu jarrihi al yaw li annahu musanna. And then I put deliberately jaat to give you the example of hatani. So what is hatani, brothers and sisters? Jaa fiel tautani si. And then hatani fa'ilun marfuun. وَعَلَامَةُ رَفْعِهِ الْعَلِفُ لِأَنَّهُ مُسَنَّ Is it clear? Sister Fatima, does it make sense? You have to make yourself a little bit stronger in understanding the dual form. Huh? Remember brothers and sisters, it is coming. It will come again in the lesson. But if I say to you brothers and sisters, هَذَانِ kitabani. So what is hazani? Muftada. How do I describe? Muftada is always marfu. Hazani, muftada, marfun, wa alamatu rafihi, al alifu. Are you with me? Let me write it down. Hazani. Huh? Is it marfu or mansub or majroor? Marfu. What is the sign of marfu? Al alifu. Huh? Why? Why? Because it is dual. That's, you have to explain. Huh? Now I say hazaini, brother and sisters. Is it mansub, majroor? But let's say it's mansub. Because usually we say kitabun, kitaban, kitabin. We say muhammadun, muhammadan, muhammadin. We make majroor form come at the end. Mansub comes in the middle. So hazaini, hazani, hazaini. It's mansu. How do I know it is mansu? 
What is the sign of it? Yeah. yeah. It is Mansu Paya. Now I say Hazaini. Now this is Majrur because Kitabun, Kitaban, Kitabin. Muhammadun, Muhammadan, Muhammadin. Hazani, Hazaini, Hazaini. Uh, is Hazaini Majrur? Yes. What is the sign of its Majrur? Yeah. yeah. So this is what Sister Fatima, you have to understand. Huh? Inshallah. Okay, brothers and sisters. So, Ja'at Hatani. Okay. Then, Ra'aytu Hataini. Same thing. Mafulun bihi mansubun walamatu nasbihi aliyahu. Liannahu musanna. And then, Salamtu ala Hataini. Same. Ismun majrurun walamatu jarrihi aliyahu. Liannahu Musanna. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? That is our group number two. Group number three. Al Asma'ul Mausula. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Asma'ul Ishara, demonstrative pronoun. Asma'ul Mausula, relative pronoun. Remember, I told you once, or maybe I said to you several times, that all the Mayr are huh? Mabni. They are all Mabni and they are all definite. They are all definite. They are definite ones, okay? And now we are learning the exception of it. That in Asma'ul Ishara, the dual form is Muarab. Huh? And uh, al, uh, Asma'ul Mausula, again the same thing, the dual form is Muarab. Got the idea? So, Al-Lazi is Mabni. Allati is Mabni, Allazina is Mabni, what about Allazani and Allatani? More, brothers and sisters. Okay? Now I'm changing it, brother. I'm changing a little bit, brother. Ja'a Allazani. Yadrusani Al Lazaini Yadru Sani. And then what would I say here, brother? Salam to Allah 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 Lazaini. Yadrusani. Now I come here, brother. What will I say here? Ja'at al Latani Tadrusani. Now I come here, brother. Raitu al. Brother, sister, if you'll write down, then you will have a permanent record. And then when you will revise, inshallah, you'll understand it very beautifully. Raitu lataini tadru sani. And then salam tu ala alal lataini. Tadrusani. Got the idea, brothers and sisters? So, Allazani, what is Allazani? Relative pronoun. Huh? Two of them. So, Jaa, Fial Madi, where is the file? Allazani. So this is Muarab. So how will I describe? Fa'ilun marfu'un. Wa alamatu rafa'i alalifu. Same. The Muarab of the, uh, the grammatical analysis of the dual form. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? So I have to mention Yadru Sani. Why? Yadru Sani. Why should I mention this Rafza? 
because when uh, Isam Mausula comes, there's a Silatul Mausul. Uh, two who are studying came. Uh, who are those two that came? Two of them came. Who are those two? The two who are studying came. You can say Yadrusani fil Jamia, you can say Bil Jamia, you can say. But Yadrusani is good enough because it is fiel and file. Huh? Fine. And then Raitu Ladaini, I saw two of them. Who are those two of them? Who are studying. Say? So Yadrusani in all the cases is Silatul Mausud. Fiel file. Are you with me? Huh? There's a complete sentence as a Silatul Mausud. I greeted two of those. Who are those two of? Who are they? They are studying. Okay, so fine. Now, same way, Allah Ta'ani, the two uh, of them came, those two are feminine, and they are studying. So, instead of Yadrusani, it became Tadrusani. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? And now, Raitu Lataini, I saw two of them who are studying. Salam to Allah Lataini. I saw two of those feminine who are studying. So that's the way it is. Huh? So in other words, Allah Zani, Allah Zaini, Allah Zaini, Allah Tani, Allah Taini, Allah Taini. They are Muarabani, Muarabani. They are declinable. Now, brothers and sisters, <coughs> we come to number four. Group number four. Asmaul Istifham. We know a little bit about it, brothers and sisters. Remember, in the beginning we say A and Hal, they are Harfu Istifham. Then we had Ma, Aina, uh, and Mata, and all these things are Ismul Istifham. They are Ism, but they are also Mabni. They are Mabni. What are they, brother? Man, Aina, Ma, Mata, Kaifa. These are also Mabani. Okay? And then we will have to describe them as they come. You know? Whether they are Marfu, or Mansu, or Majrur, the sentence will tell us, brothers and sisters. Some of these things are for you to make a note of it. When we'll study deeper with grammatical analysis, then all of them will come, inshallah. Now, Badu Zuruf, what is Zuruf? Rural of Zarf, adverbs. Some of the adverbs are also Mabni. What are they, brothers and sisters? Eza. What is the meaning of Eza? When or if? Both, okay. al we know that al-ana, zarfu zaman, but that's mabni. Huh? That's mabni. Okay, it won't change its form. Haithu, where? Haithu means where. So it is also mabni. Fine. And then, brother and sister, amsi, also mabni. Huh? These are all zarf. Are you with me, brother and sisters? Huh? I don't think you'll find them difficult. Huh? Okay, inshallah, when you will revise, you will feel comfortable. Now, there are some uh, nouns which are called Asmaul Af'ali. We have never used the plural form. I always say Ismu Fi'ali. What I say? Ismu Fi'ali. We are going to learn a little bit more. Let me tell you briefly. Ismu Fi'ali. Uh, looks like a noun, but does the job of verb. And it does not have the signs of the normal verb. Okay? And yet, it does the job of verb. But in it looks, it looks like a noun. Fine. Here, brother and sister, Amin. What is Amin, brother? Uh, no, Amin looks like a noun, but it is a verb. Uh, it is Amar. Okay? What is the meaning of Amin? Please accept. Are you with me? Accept our dua. 
Huh? Who is the file? Mustatir takdir hu anta. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That, ya Allah, accept it. Okay, fine. And then, often, when you are tired of somebody, you say, uff. Huh? Are you with me, brother? So what is uff, brother? Also, ismu fial. Huh? Where is the file? Mustatir. Takdir hu ana. I am tired of you. Huh? Okay? I am sick and tired of you. Okay? I don't like it. You know? And then, ahin. What is the meaning of ahi? Ah. Ah. Huh? I am in pain. When you say ah, ah, it means I am in pain. So it is a verb. Okay, brothers and sisters? And where is the file? Mustatir. Takadiruhu? Ana. So in both, brothers and sisters, Ufin and Ahin, it is Takadiruhu? Ana. Because you are saying, I am in pain. But then somebody is in pain, you won't say, Ah, Ah. <laughs> that person has to say, Ah, Ah. Okay? And as a joke, I have added one more, brother. In English, what we say normally, you like something, what do you say? Wow. 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 What is the meaning of wow? Huh? The wow meaning is the damir mustatirun takdiru ana. Means I like it. What do you say? What, when do you say wow? When you like something. So, brother, wow, where is the I like hidden? It is inside. Damir mustatir. But I don't say like that, brother. I say, wow. Aha, aha. <laughs> Are you with me? Because if you like it, that's the way. Aha, aha. I like it. Aha, aha. So one of the sisters said, brother and sister, uh, he asked me, brother Asif, I understand wow means I like it. What is this aha, aha? <laughs> I said, sister, that is mafulun mutlak. <laughs> that is mafulun mutlak means I like it very much. <laughs> Alhamdulillah. <laughs> this is just a joke, brothers and sisters. It's not mentioned here. Uh, Amin, Ufin, and Ahin. Now we come to number seven, brothers and sisters. We already studied it. We have some idea, we will now learn in detail. Al-Adadu, this is the jama of Adad. Murakkabatu, Murakkab, compound. It is coming from Rakkaba. Yurakkibu, Murakka, ismu maful, compound. Ahada Ashara. What is it? Ahada Ashara. Brother, it will never change. It's mabni. Huh? So this you will then be saying, fi mahalli, fi mahalli rafa'in, or fi mahalli nasbin, or fi mahalli charrin. Whenever they will come in the sentence. Tisata huh? ashara, athalitha ashara. No, these are all mabni. But there's an exception here. الجذل الأول من إثنا عشرة معرب. Remember, brothers and sisters, أحد عشرة is a compound. There are two parts, أحد and عشرة. There are part one and part two. When you say إثنا عشرة, there is a part one, part two. Part one is معرب, and part two is مبني. So here is is there an example, brothers and sisters? Yadrusu fil fasli ithna ashara taliban. Fine, brothers and sisters. Yadrusu fil fasli ithna ashara taliban. Where is the file for Yadrusu? Ithna ashara. Ithna ashara. 
Uh, you can say even Ahada Ashara. You can say all these things. You can say, brother and sister, you can say Tisata Ashara, Salatata Ashara. You can say. But when you say Ifna Ashara, then Isna, brother and sister, is the dual form. Remember, if Nani, if Naini, if Naini, then this dual form, brother and sisters, you will have to give the Arab of Musanna. What will you give the Arab of? Masanna. So what will you say, brother and sister? You will say, Isna. Al-Juzul Awwalu. Fa'ilun. Marfu'un. Wa alamatu rafa'ihi. Al-Alif. Are you with me, brothers? Liannahu Musalam. You got the idea? Fine. Now if, I, if you say, Ra'itu Ithnai. The noon is dropped. It's naini, the noon is dropped. We are going to learn later on why. It's nai ashara. So, brother, what is it's nai? Bafulun bihi. Are you with me? Bafulun bihi. Wa alamatu nasbihi. Al yaw. Are you with me? But the second part is mabni. The second part is mabni. Fine. taamu. This food is for whom? Li lithnai. What is it? Lithnai ashara taliban. Okay, brothers and sisters, let us analyze this. Hada mubta. Attaamu badal mashala badal. Li harchar ithnai ism majru. Ismun majrurun wa alamatu jarrihi al yaw. Li annahu musanna. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Lianahu Musanna. And Ashara uh, is also Ismun Majrurun Mabniun ala Fata. Fi Mahali Jar. Are you with me? Fine. And what is Taliban? Tamiz. I, I'm glad that you did not forget Tamiz. Alhamdulillah. See, do you see how we an, analyze Ithna, Ithnai, Ithnai? So in this uh, Adadul Murakab, uh, in the compound, everything is mabni except juz awalu min ithna ashara. Uh, so you will inshallah remember this. Uh, and it is given here, brother, sisters. If you want to write down, you can write down quickly, brother and sisters. Yadrusu fil fasli. Are you with me? Ithna ashara taliban. Ithna, you can write down. Marfoon bil alif. What will you write down? Marfoon bil alif. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Huh? You can write down the detail, huh? Sister Mehnas? Absolutely. Huh? You write down in detail, but I am just write down marfuun. It's marfu with what? Alif. Alif. And then, if you say raitu with nai, then juz awal is uh, man subun bil yai. Are you with me, yeah, Sister Hafsa? And then haza tamu li lif nai. Uh, it will be majroorun uh, again bil yai. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Just make a note of it in your book. And we will be saying this in detail whenever we get an opportunity. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Inshallah. <clears throat> so these are the seven groups. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? In which uh, they are all mabni. Okay? They are all mabni. So this is what the meaning is. Al asma'u kulluha muarabatun ma'ada al fiati al atiyata. Number one, the Ma'ir. They are all Morab except the following groups, which are Mabni. Huh? The Ma'ir, 
اسماء وشارة اسماء موصولة اسماء استفام اسماء افعال ان الاداد مرقبت ان شاء الله you will remember this now I have one suggestion to give you brother book 3 has so many concepts one on top of other they will keep on following in, in a steady succession we have to revise it often and if you write down your notes properly then the revision will become very easy and you will be able to understand it very fast inshallah whenever the opportunity will come we'll revise them inshallah in the lessons inshallah I think we are ready for a break let's take a short break 10 to 15 minutes and then we'll resume inshallah alhamdulillah brother we're back <coughs> After our break, our batteries are recharged with some nice hot tea and some cookies, inshallah. Now, brothers and sisters, we go to page number seven. Alamatul Arabi. Alamatul Arabi. Now, here, Arab means declension. Alamatul Arabi. Al Asliyatu. Now, Al Asliyatu, brothers and sisters, is a not for Alamat. Uh, this is a not for alamat. Alamatul Arabi, that is mudaf mudafilehi. Then al asliyatu is a not for alamatu. That is why it is marfu. Can you see? Well, fariyatu. What is the meaning of al asliyatu, brothers and sisters? The original sign of declension. What is the original sign of declension, brother? Dhamma. Fata and Kasra. These are the original signs. And then Fariyatu means secondary signs, you know, or branch signs. Huh? I always joke, brother. What is the opposite of Asli? Nakli. <laughs> These are not Nakli, brother. These are secondary. These are secondary. Secondary endings, you know. Alamatu Arabi al Asliyatu. Well, ism, what is they, brothers and sisters? What are they? Adamatu, wa hiya alamatu rafi. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? Write down next to it if you want to. Muhammadun Talibun. Al Fatahatu, wa hiya alamatu nasbi. Write down example. Raitu Muhammadan. Are you with me, brothers and sisters? I, I'm sure you can write it. Raitu Muhammadan wa kathratu wa hiya alamatu jarri. How will you write down? Salamtu ala Muhammadin. What will you say? Salamtu ala Muhammadin. If you write down these three, three sentences next to each other, it will be nice for you. Do you want me to write it on board? And the first one, brother, Adamma. Huh? Adamatu. What will you write down, brother? Muhammadun Talibun. Talibun. Huh, brother? And then Al Fathatu. Huh? Raaitu Muhammadan. Huh? And then Al Kasratu. What will be the sign, brother? Salam to Allah Muhammadin. Are you with me, brother and sisters? Alhamdulillah. Now, these are the original signs. Alamatu Al Arabi, Alamatu Al Arabi, Al Asliyatu. وَهُنَاكَ أَلَامَةٌ أُخْرَى And what are they called, brother? فَرْعِيَّةٌ وَهُنَاكَ أَلَامَةٌ أُخْرَى فَرْعِيَّةٌ وَهِيَ And they are فِي أَنْوَاهِ الْآتِيَةِ They are in the following, of following kinds. They are in the following kinds. مِنَ الْأَسْمَى Again, we are still talking about nouns only. Huh? 
different kinds of uh, secondary signs in the nouns. Number one. See, brother and sister, this is all repetition. We have been learning it. You know a little bit now in detail, brother. Jama Mona Salim. Huh? See, now I tell you one thing. Remember, we had a page where you were doing your uh, 